We're in Wellington. Uh, beside the big Catholic Cathedral. Town's having a very good sniff around. We're here for a Bassett Waddle. Tomorrow. Today, we're just enjoying the scenery. We're going to find something to eat. These dogs are not used to the big city. It'll be interesting to see how they react. We're in downtown Wellington. Mum and Junior have gone off to get some lunch. The hounds are chilling in the shade. They don't call it Windy Wellington for nothing. These dogs are pretty relaxed given they've not really been in a city environment like this before. They've been saying hello to all the locals. We've got the Bassett Waddle tomorrow. I'm not sure how many Bassett's going to be there, but I believe quite a few. What do you reckon, Angus? Here we are at Parliament House. Hounds are excited. Angus is only interested in sniffing. He hasn't seen the beautiful architecture behind me. That's the main Parliament House. And we'll go behind this tree in a minute. And there's a building they call the Beehive. Pretty interesting choice for architecture, but you'll see what I'm talking about in a second. Blowing a gale. These dogs have just had their lunch. Hopefully they'll behave. Beautiful day in New Zealand's capital, Wellington. That's the beehive. It's where they have offices and what have you. It's Parliament House. Built that in 1922. They started it in like 1914. Finished it in 1922. It's had a big reno. I think it burnt down at some stage too. big steps in the front, we're not allowed to go on there, and we're certainly not allowed to film, you have to get the express permission of the Speaker of the House, which we don't have. Perhaps could have gotten it, but I wasn't that forward thinking. Parliament House, that's where they have the big debating chamber, in the Speaker's office, and where they do all their pointless committees. Millie is still bored to tears. Angus still couldn't get this. It's blowing a gale. See the New Zealand flag up there blowing around like no tomorrow. We had to give the stairs a miss. I don't think Millie would have made it down there. The stairs taller than her leg. We're directly underneath the beehive. There's all kinds of rumours about what's down in the basement of the beehive. Mere citizens like myself will probably never know. This is the main gate to Parliament. During the COVID lockdown mandate there was a massive protest here. The protesters had a riot with police right here. Well, a great deal of it was right here. 150 of our police officers injured. Disgusting. Not one of New Zealand's finest moments, that's for sure. What do you think, Angus? 
I support people's right to protest and I'll die on that hill but anytime someone injures our brave police, we've got a big problem. No good. I imagine the audio is going to be dreadful due to the wind. Millie's ready to go. She's had quite enough of Parliament. Angus is still pretty excited. Gonna go and wander up past the main building one last time. Incredible building. I feel like I should know who that statue is of, but can't be much of a patriot because I wouldn't have a bloody clue. Angus far more interested in sniffing every shrub in the architecture kit. That right there is the parliamentary library. Never been in there, but I imagine it's full of books. <laughs> Angus still doesn't care. We're off home. Well, we're off back to our Airbnb. I'm guessing Millie is going to sleep probably until it's time to go to the Bassett Waddle tomorrow. Angus, still plenty of energy. Right, time to leave Parliament. Let's go!